Hey, what's up, Lucrative Nation? This is your girl Pam Obasa from The Lucrative Lady, and I'm so excited to share this with you. I have discovered something like incredible. I'm not even kidding. I want to show you how this video about trains is making $147,000 from a video about trains. I repeat, a video about trains. Most importantly, I want to show you how you can make money by creating videos on YouTube without getting in front of the camera. Yes, I know, I just became your new best friend. That's right. Listen, if you hate being in front of the camera, it's okay. You can still make money off this big, massive, lucrative pie that is YouTube, even if you are not creating the content. Whoever knew that there was such a thing? Well, Pam does, I do. So stay tuned because this is going to be an incredible video. I cannot wait to show you what I discovered and how you can do it too. Let's go. So welcome back. I want to show you in this video how to make at least $100 per day by re-uploading videos on YouTube. Now a lot of people don't realize this but there is something called Creative Commons on YouTube which gives you the right to download a video off of YouTube, you know, put your own spice on the video, i.e. change the thumbnail, add some music or something um, to the video, making it your own, and then re-uploading it to YouTube. And that way you already have something that's proven. Because here's the thing about YouTube, it's incredibly difficult to keep creating content, searching for what will work, what is gonna go viral, what's gonna get me the most views and all of those things. I know because I've been doing it for the last few months. So it is difficult, but what if there was a way that you can figure out what has already worked because somebody else has done the testing for you and you can just piggyback off of their test and get a massive amount of views to your channel using a video that they created or they found. You can do that and it is totally, totally perfect and it is totally okay by YouTube because it is something called Creative Commons that gives you the right and the license to be able to do what I'm sharing with you right now, just like this video of the trains did. So I wanna go on my laptop and just quickly show you some of the things that I've you know, found out, my new toys, and that I'm playing with in terms of testing that I want you to test because it is fun. Making money is fun if you know how. So let's hop to my laptop. Let's take a look at what I can see and let me show you how you can do it. But before we go, I have something to share with you. A lot of people are gonna wanna skip this video. You wanna skip all the way to the end. You wanna find out what is it, Pam? Can you tell me really quickly? One thing I will say is I don't want you to get yourself in trouble by making mistakes. That means you've gotta follow everything that I share with you in this video. So don't skip a beat, don't try and follow Fast forward it, just be patient, watch everything, take notes, and then you have the ability to take action and so that you can get better results. So if we are okay, and if you agree to actually watching it and taking action, then follow me to my laptop, let's go. Come back, I wanna show you real quick what I have discovered. Before we do that, I wanna tell you exactly what Creative Commons is. This is the thing that allows you to be able to do this. I did a quick Google, and here is Creative Commons is a license that provides a standard way for content creators to grant someone else permission to use their work. So what that basically means is that as a content creator, as you are uploading a video to YouTube, you have the uh, ability to click a button that says Creative Commons. And all that does is it says to other YouTubers that they can use the video. So I'm sure you've seen other videos of compilation, you've seen motivational videos, you've seen videos of other preachers, you know, you might see somebody like Joyce Meyer, TD Jakes, but their videos aren't on their channel. It is because um, they've given creative commons, meaning that somebody else can actually grab that video and upload it to their channel and still get the views. Do you see what I'm trying to say? So that's how it works. This is the law that gives you the ability to do this. So let's look at some real examples for how you can do this and how much money you can possibly make. So if we um, take a quick look at this example, right? So train videos, right? Something so mundane. I mean, who wants to watch train videos? Well, apparently 49 million views, so 49 million people or views, whoever, you know, have watched this one video, right? So this is a 49 million. And um, this is a tool that I have, which is keywords um, everywhere, which gives you insights. And it tells me that a hundred, there's a video with 155 million views right here. So let me try and find it. So we have 33 
1,229,000 at 3.7 million. So I'm looking for the big number, 1.5 million, 52 million here, 13 million. Can you see? And here it is, 155 million views in two years from this video from a kids channel, Super Kids TV. So now you might be thinking, so what does this actually mean when it comes to views? Well, here is the thing, when it comes to YouTube, um, my sources tell me that for every 1,000 views you have on YouTube, um, YouTube pays you $3. So that means that if you, that means that for per 1,000 view, it's actually $3,000. So let's look at the calculator, let's look at 49 million. So we would have to do 3,000, so 3,000, one, two, three times, 49 equals 149, 147,000, right? So this top video right here that has had 49 million views has made this amount of money, $147,000. Now, do you remember the other video we saw, the kids TV that had, I think it was 115 views. So let's have a look and um, let's have a look at that. And let me see how to, how do I delete this? Give me one second. Okay, brilliant. So 115 times 3,000. One, two, three. Whoa! <laughs> they have made over a quarter of a million. So 345,000 for this, uh, this video of kids right uh where is that video of kids there are so many videos of you know here oh it's just moved um where is it there are so many videos here that have made a ton of money there it is in a second there it is right so how do you do this well what you have to think is well what sort of videos do i want to create so i like um i like kids things i like trains i also typed in fitness because as you know, fitness is a massive, massive niche. And the very first video that popped up is this one right here. 58 million views for this 37 minute video. So just imagine that somebody spent 37 minutes recording this video and they've already racked up 58 million views and are making a serious amount of money from doing this. Okay, so you might be thinking, but Pam, how do I know, you know, what I have the right to use? What is Creative Commons? Well, let me show you. So when, so here, as you know, is the search field for what you can search, but to find out what is Creative Commons, all you have to do is go into filter over here and click here, Creative Commons. Now, once you've done that, let me just make sure that it's up. Can you see that my screen has changed? Okay, so once you have done that, YouTube now shows you what does have Creative Commons, okay? So this one where it says My Morning Routine 2019 has Creative Commons. So that means that somebody could easily use this video. So all of these have creative commons in them so let me have a look so um my tool over here tells me that the one with the maximum views when it comes to fitness the word fitness has 5.1 million views now if i type in let me try trains again right and then let me go back to creative commons let's find out what has the biggest view okay brilliant Okay, so maximum views for this is a video that has 5.3 million, if you can see that on the right here, right? So it tells me there is a video on here that has done really, really well because it's racked up 5.3 million views, okay? So this is the thing, guys. So what do you have to do to be able to achieve this? Now, before I jump into that, I wanna give a quick shout out to our comment of the day. We're starting a new thing, spotlighting comments uh, because you're so gracious with your comments and I wanna see more of them. So to be the one spotlighted below, all you have to do is of course, subscribe to the channel, turn on the notification and the bell and leave a great comment and you get to be spotlighted. So that's what you have to do. Now, let me keep going. So. Um, some of the keywords that I like to do, um, obviously trains, fitness, makeup, um, kids stuff, pranks is a really, really, really good one. Um, makeup is a really fantastic one as well that you would see lots of videos with creative comments and that have racked up so many views. So I wanna quickly run down the steps that you have to take. So the first thing you have to do is of course, find the right videos that you want to use. And then the next thing you want to do is, let me type in makeup here. 
let's see the next thing you see do is you want to download um, the videos that you want to create a compilation of right so it doesn't it doesn't even have to be a compilation you just want to find the right videos you then want to download the videos and once you have done that you then make a decision as to what you want to do do you want to create a compilation so do you want to download several videos and make it a longer video and um, perhaps it's uh, so this one has under for the word makeup there's a video with 24 million views which is this one right here right so now do you want to just use the video as it is or do you want to make it you know into something new so that means you're going to string together maybe two or three videos that also have creative commons remember it must have that string those together then of course the next thing you do is now figure out okay brilliant how can i create a, a great thumbnail for this to make it different make it a little bit unique and make it mine and then of course you do your youtube seo before you upload it to your channel now if you want to find out how much money um a lot of um, channels are actually making i love a tool called social blade so if we have a look let me see where social blade is so social blade um is a really good place that you can really see you know how much money people are making so let me look at somebody like marie folio um let's look at how much money she might be making from her youtube channel so here we are so i found marie she has a couple of channels quite a few channels um but so social blade tells me that she's making an estimated earning of um 1.6k per month or 19,000 per year which is relatively quite low so social blade is a really good site but the numbers can be quite low compared to what it really is so whatever it tells you you can just assume that it's a lot more than that if we look at somebody like dan Locke, let's see how much money he is bringing in so again he has um multiple channels so let's see how much he's bringing in. So bring, so Dan Mark is making as much as $220,000 per year from just having his videos on YouTube. So one of the things about creating content on YouTube is that you know that this is real passive income. So you have to spend time to create the content, yes, but once it's done, it keeps racking up views and keeps paying you and that's where the passive income really does come in. What I love about um, what I love about, you know, the idea of creating these compilation videos or uploading something else and making it your own under Creative Commons is that you don't have the, you know, added headache or hang up of thinking about what type of content should, should I create? You know, now I need to put my makeup and get my hair done. And, you know, what do I say on camera? And if you're camera shy, this is just a great way to just get used to creating a really great content that gets an incredible amount of views. So if I type in the word motivation, let's see what happens okay so apparently there's a video on motivation that has 84 million views right so you can see that these keywords uh, and here it is right here you can see that oh i think it's a music video this one actually um you can see that these um keywords are absolutely crazy you know prank fitness makeup motivation anything like that um you can do your own search but ultimately you just want to take action and get on with this because there is no barrier to entry just make sure you go into filter and make sure you click on creative commons and anything that comes up that has creative commons means that you have the ability to use use that on your channel to create your own content so there you have it i hope you loved it if you loved it let me know you loved it by giving me the thumbs up subscribing to this channel and of course leaving a comment because um we might be able to spotlight your comment in our next video and don't forget to let me know in the comments um what action are you going to take what did you think of this strategy do you think it's something that you might use do you think it's something that you know did you feel intrigued something that you are tempted to try i think it's a really great strategy i mean if you YouTube is willing to help you to make more money. They just want to give you more money because guess what? They need more content and you are creating the content in a different way, but you're still creating the content. Then I don't see why not. So thank you so much for joining me. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel and I look forward to seeing you in my next video. See you soon. Bye-bye.